So in what other ways, like other than the primary problem that we already discussed, does user guiding help your business? My title is the director of implementations. I mm -hmm. lead the onboarding team for new sales. And I'm also heading up our, what we're calling a migration project internally, getting people off of our legacy software onto this cloud-based software. Because of this migration project and all these users not knowing the new software, we had to get information in front of them immediately. So on each major screen, we have a video overview of how it works and a written documentation if you want to jump into it. So that's kind of the how to use it sort of solve. But the other thing that we're starting to branch into is using resource centers to get information in front of them while they're in the software to keep them from having to go to other tabs or external sources. And one of the ways we did that was we have different user types in our system. And depending on the user type, they see different things in the resource center, like mm -hmm. guided journeys or recommended articles or the search field for our support center so they can look at articles without having to leave the software like we talked about before.